Here I have an apparent problem with the multiplexing. It's just a blur. The, the numbers aren't very distinguished. Um, I think right there it's meant to be reading 0633. 0640. Uh, it's a clock, so it's counting up in seconds and minutes. I can add a 60 second delay to the whole program and instead I get hours and minutes. Um, what I can do, just to show that the multiplexing is working fine, um, I'll introduce a delay on the program um, in the sort of place where it would, uh, it, you know, basically create a pause between switching on and off the delays, sorry, the displays. So this is just to show that the multiplexing does work. Though it's rather dim when I do that. Um, if I add it, and that, that's a significant delay. But if I'll tell you what, I'll put it in a different place so that it should shine brighter. Um, Yeah, I'll stick it about there. Upload it. Oh, that's better. <clears throat> you see, so the multiplexing does work. Um, actually, I'll make that go a bit, a bit slower. Um, and I don't know if the camera is picking it up all right, but. There's none of that ghosting like there was before. I know it's different. It's difficult to tell when the camera's hunting around for focus. Never. This thing never focuses right. Um, but there's there's no ghosting like there was before. There's no blur. Um, I can't tell by looking on the on the screen of the camera, but there's the the, the numbers that are popping up are quite distinguished. There's no doubt about what numbers they are. And um, if I just take away that delay uh, and re-upload, again now we've got that sort of blurring as um, uh, counting up. That's eight, nine, seven. I don't know. That's zero one zero zero one one zero one three zero one four zero one five. I don't know, that left hand digit went to 8 there for a second, although that middle segment was a lot dimmer than, than the others. I just, I just know what's going on. Maybe, maybe the transistors aren't switching fast enough. Um, I, I don't know. 